Hey guys, welcome to a tutorial today on how to build a moving truck or a U-Haul truck. I'm not sure if they have that overseas, but basically U-Haul is like a, a company to where you can move your own stuff and store your own stuff. And so we might make a storage unit later on. Uh, not this video, but in like another video. So how about we get started with the materials. So this is what we are making. So you can use other colors if you want. These are just the ones I'm using. Just kind of keep that in mind. You will need wool, just white wool, orange wool, quartz stairs, quartz slabs, stone slabs, gray wool, glass, pillar quartz blocks, a tripwire hook, which we also need uh, glass panes. Let's just type it in here. There it is. Oh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else at the moment, so we should be good for now. So let's get started. We're going to start with our gray wool. So what we're going to do is just lay one down and then come one block away. On the second block, add another, so you should have one block gap in between. Okay, take out your stone slabs, and we're going to make a upside down, whoop, those are in stone. And you're going to have your stone slabs come all the way across like this, connecting the two together. Okay. So what we're going to do next is take out your quartz stairs and you're going to place one on each side facing out uh, away from uh, the actual car itself. Place a just a quart block here in the middle like this and so now it kind of looks like a full piece. Now behind the stairs we could add just more stone slabs like this. Boop boop boop. So I extended out the stone slabs two blocks past the tires here. So take back out your quartz slabs. Basically, you're just going to add full blocks behind the stairs coming all the way across. And then on the sides, what you're going to do is extend out the quartz one more block. So you should have one block here in the middle for the driver. So next, we're going to take our glass and basically put your glass on top of the full blocks that we just added. Just like that. Really simple. Not much to it. Okay. So next, take out your quartz slab. And on the second block, um, not this very first block. Uh, layer of glass, but the second layer basically have your slabs come all the way across just like that and connect the two You should not have anything on top of this set of glass here and then on the second block from The from the tire here basically you're just gonna make this into a full block just like this Do 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 so let's stack it all the way up Boom just like that. So this is basically the cabin of our car here or our truck So next we can take out our white wool and we're going to extend it one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll go seven blocks. And basically, we're just going to just make this into a full piece here. Boom, just like that. Now, we are not going to add slabs on the bottom half here, so do not worry about that. I want you to come out with your white wool. And on the second layer of slab here, basically put it on top just like that. It should be hovering above. That's what we want. And basically, what we're going to do now is basically just kind of make this into a solid wall on both sides. Just like this, do do do. Okay, fill all this in. Make sure we get this back wall set in there. Perfect. And basically, you notice we're leaving the middle lane of the truck kind of empty because that's where your stuff would actually go for storage. And then the one up here in the middle, boom. And voila, now we can kind of see the shape taking its place. So here in the middle, right here, actually, never mind. Take out your quartz stairs, and we're gonna add a quartz stair on top like this on both sides with our orange wool here in the middle just for a little bit more decoration again you can use any color you want if you want to change it up also taking your orange wool basically let's get rid of all the second block here and basically you're going to put orange wool there again you can change the colors if you want these are not you know set colors that you have to use and boom perfect so next what you need to do is take out your gray wool and we're going to make the back tires so the back tires are going to be one block away. Actually, let's go two blocks away from the back here and do the same thing on both sides. So it should be on the third block. Get rid of the white wool on top of that tire and replace it with a quartz stair, upside down quartz stair that is. Boop, do that on both sides, perfect. Then you can kind of see it's finished, like it's final shape. Next, take out your stone slabs and we're gonna have a slab right here on the back and it's gonna come all the way across like this. And it's going to actually extend one block past the actual tailgate itself. We, we can get rid of this bottom piece of wool right there. And you're going to replace it with a pillar quartz block. And you want these to be sideways like this. This kind of resembles the door that's going to be opened up to put all your stuff in. 
Uh, our glass panes real quick so we can put these away. Our glass panes will go here on this front window. These kind of resemble your mirrors a little bit. Okay, we're looking pretty good. We're almost done. Uh, another material we will need is a fence. So you take out your fence. Boop. And you will also need your trip wire here now. And one more material that you will need is white carpet. I didn't have enough. Okay, I get... There we go, here it is. We'll get rid of the gray wool. Let's go time set zero. And there we go. So basically your fence is gonna come all the way up on both sides from the back. And it's kinda go up. These kind of are just there for decoration. You don't have to add those if you want. Your tripwire hook will go right here in the bottom part of this. This is so you can actually kind of lift up the door. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Your white carpet will go on top and basically cover up your cords and just come all the way back. And so basically we're going to have this go all the way on top, just covering up everything. Boom, perfect, looking pretty good. And a couple finishing touches that we need to add so we can kind of get rid of all this material. You will need to take out some wooden buttons and some stone buttons. So I'm going to take out both now. So your stone buttons, or just the ones that look like stone, will go on the tires. Kind of make them look a little bit better and more realistic. Boom, perfect. And then your wooden buttons are going to go right here on both sides. Just like this. And come all the way to the back and you're going to have one on the very end like this. And boom, now we have a fully finished moving truck. So you can't even make these bigger if you want. Uh, you can make this basically as big as you want if you really want to. I think this is a pretty good size. It's pretty realistic size in my opinion. So I think we're done for this tutorial. Thank you very much for watching guys. It is greatly appreciated. Let me know in the comments if you want to see a storage like building for a tutorial. Uh, if you do, I will look into it if enough people want it. So bye bye guys. Thank you very much for watching. It is greatly appreciated as always. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye bye.